Have you ever questioned the traditional view of Jesus, the son of Joseph and Mary? It's a thought-provoking question, isn't it? Often we accept the narratives handed down to us without much scrutiny. But what if we dared to challenge the norm? Enter Mulat Tazabu, a man who dares to do just that. Tazabu proposes a radical reinterpretation of Jesus, not as a literal figure, but as a metaphor, an allegory for the human experience. In Tazabu's perspective, the life and birth of Jesus are not historical realities, but symbolic representations of our struggles, our triumphs, our very humanity. He challenges the age-old narratives, asking us to see Jesus as not just a figure in a story, but as a symbol of our own journey. This perspective leads us to a new realm of understanding, where Jesus becomes a metaphor for the human journey. Here lies the question. Was Mary a virgin during her pregnancy? Mulat Tazabu, a thought-provoking scholar, invites us to reconsider this deeply ingrained belief. He challenges the traditional Christian narrative that Mary was a virgin when she conceived Jesus through the Holy Spirit. Instead, he suggests that this narrative is not literal, but symbolic. The crux of Tazabu's argument is rooted in the Old Testament, the first part of the Christian Bible. According to him, there is no specific prophecy about Jesus in this text. This point of view is indeed a departure from the conventional Christian understanding which identifies several Old Testament prophecies as foretelling the coming of Jesus. But Tazabu doesn't stop there. He further distinguishes between Jesus and Emmanuel, two figures deeply embedded within the Christian tradition. For many, Emmanuel is another name for Jesus, a sign of his divine nature. However, Tazabu proposes a different interpretation. In his view, Emmanuel is not Jesus, but a singular, inseparable entity that is timeless and placeless. This is in stark contrast to Jesus, who Tazabu sees as representing duality and the necessity for the ego's death on the cross to liberate humanity. This perspective, while controversial, brings a fresh lens to look at the narrative of Jesus, encouraging us to delve beyond the literal and explore the metaphorical. It invites us to see Mary not as a literal virgin mother, but as a symbol of humanity's spiritual journey. Could this perspective change how we see the story of Jesus and its significance for humanity? It certainly opens up new avenues of thought and compels us to question and reflect on our understanding of religious narratives. Whether or not one agrees with Tazabu's interpretation, it serves as a valuable reminder of the richness and diversity of religious beliefs and the importance of engaging with different viewpoints. After all, in the realms of faith and spirituality, there is always room for interpretation and exploration. What if we looked at the story of Jesus not as a literal historical fact, but as a symbolic journey. This is the question that Mulat Tazabu poses to us, challenging our traditional understanding of Jesus and sparking a thought-provoking conversation about the nature of religious beliefs and narratives. Tazabu invites us to view Jesus not as a singular historical figure, but as a symbol of the human experience. In his interpretation, Jesus embodies the struggles and triumphs of humanity. The birth, life, and death of Jesus become metaphoric expressions of our own journeys, encapsulating the duality of human existence and the transformative power of self-sacrifice. Tazabu's perspective also encourages us to reevaluate the role of Mary and the significance of the virgin birth. By suggesting that Mary was not a literal virgin, Tazabu challenges a central tenet of Christian faith. Instead, he proposes that the story of Mary's miraculous conception should be understood symbolically as a metaphor for the divine spark within all of us. So what implications does this interpretation hold? Well, by viewing Jesus as a symbol rather than a historical figure, we are encouraged to delve deeper into the biblical narratives. It pushes us to look beyond the surface and seek the metaphorical truths hidden within the stories. In doing so, we may gain a richer understanding of our own experiences and our place in the world. Moreover, this perspective might help us to see the universality of human experiences encapsulated in the story of Jesus. It could guide us in recognizing our own struggles and triumphs in the narrative, fostering a deeper sense of empathy and connection with others. Whether or not one agrees with Tazabu's interpretation, 
It certainly serves as a reminder of the richness and complexity of religious beliefs and the importance of questioning and exploring different viewpoints. By engaging with diverse perspectives, we can deepen our understanding of our faith and perhaps find new insights and inspiration along the way.